All right, we're on uh, XFC, and this is actually my first video on here, so it's a little bit different. But these are some of the settings that I usually change when I go to different distros. And um, let me show you here. So the first thing I always get rid of icons on my desktop. So you do that: is right click and then go to desktop settings, icons, and just uncheck the ones you want. Right. And now you have a nice and neat. Other thing is that um, if you ever open a window, I don't know why they always do this on different distros, but it always opens in the freaking corner. You know, if I do this, it opens in the corner. It never goes in the center, which is usually what people want. And then you have to drag it into the middle, you know. So to fix this, uh, let's open up our, what is it, our um, settings manager here. And what you want to do is go to was it this Windows Manager tweaks here, and you want to go to placement uh, right here. Make sure this one is checked at the center of the screen, right? And you want to drag it from you know this slider here to large. And now when you open a window, it will go center. So that's how you fix that problem, right? Another thing is. Um, Oh yeah, this this example right here. So if I try to double click on my title bar, you see that it doesn't freaking work. Um, there is an option to maximize it. When you do that in here, let me show you where is it at. The Windows Manager here, Advanced, and then you go to see the double click actions. So it's by default it's maximized window, but it doesn't work. But you know they they do have some other ones like hide, if you want to use that. But maximize is what I want. Uh, the reason why it doesn't work is that their default settings for the mouse double click is too freaking fast. So you go to the mouse here and go to behavior. Uh, and in the double click timer, you want to change it to probably right here, around here. And now when you double click on this thing, it will maximize or do the actions. So that's how you fix that problem. Um, <clears throat> what's the other thing? Oh, yeah. The sessions and startup. What you want to go in here is go to yeah the uh, the applicants auto start. Re remove whatever you know the ones that you don't want to uh, load up. Especially this one, the update notifier. It keeps telling me to update to a natty, which I don't want to do. Or remove some other stuff that you don't really need. Maybe like Bluetooth or printing or whatever, if it doesn't apply to you, right? Uh, that's all you gotta do in there, and the last thing I always do is set up um, my keyboard. So I have some extra hotkeys in here. You see here, application shortcuts. So go in here. Uh, by default, the pop-up menu is at Control and Escape, but change it to Alt F1 because we're gonna use uh, this one. All right. All you gotta do is add a new one and type in. Um, you know, XSC 4 dash task manager and give that hotkey uh, control escape. That's usually what I like to do because that's how the KDE is set up. You know, control escape to open your task manager. If you ever need to kill something, then you can just, you know, kill it here uh, or look at your process, I guess. Another thing I add is X kill, right? X kill here. And I, I use the KD hotkey also, uh, Control Out Escape. And X Kill is just basically if your program is non responsive, you push uh, Control Out Escape, and then you have this little X, and then you kill it. That's it. So those are like the two hotkeys I always set up. Uh, always the same hotkey up there. Anyways, I think that's about it for our, um, you know, setup here. That's what I usually do. If you want to do it also, then that'll be it. Uh, I am gonna try to do more, maybe XFC videos, or maybe just focus on lightweight uh, applications. All right, so that's it for this one.